Today is June 1st, 2017, and it is the first official morning of vlogging. Kids and I were talking the other day before I became like really sick, and I was like, what do you guys think about vlogging? So the kids thought it was a really good idea to vlog. They're like, yeah, mom, let's try it. Um, we'll vlog every day for the full month of June and if we like it enough get enough response whatever we're probably gonna maybe extend it another month and see what happens maybe we'll end up doing a daily vlogging all the time I don't know we'll see what happens but Carl you need to live out here you liar <laughs> this guy that I work with used to work with I told him I said I know you lived out in my neighborhood and he's like no I don't and I'm like yes you do and he's like no I don't I just saw him come down for the garbage. Yes, he's going to do lots of fun stuff this summer, so I want to bring you guys with. And then in September, I'm actually homeschooling my kids. I'm pulling them out of the public school system, and I am homeschooling them. I'm not going to go into the reasons why, um, but we're all very excited. The kitchen has been transformed into a classroom, and it's actually pretty cool. I'm really super excited. I'm pretty prepared for everything, and... Um, I'm confident that it's going to work. And the curriculum that we're using is a really cool curriculum because it is 100% free. And so I don't have to pay a company to do it. And I also don't have to do it through the school district. We're going to be completely independent private school. Fridays will be field trip days. And so you guys will get to see us do that. But anyway. Hey, you guys. So I'm trying to be a little quiet because my husband's still here asleep. He leaves for work in a little bit, but oh my god, do you see this? So, <laughs> I know I'm a chubby girl, and that's fine, whatever. But, look at this. I've lost some weight since being sick. And so I decided to weigh myself, and like... Two weeks ago, I was 130 pounds. No, not 130 pounds. <laughs> I wish. It's 230 pounds. And I have lost 10 pounds, you guys. 10 freaking pounds. That's so awesome. I look like hell. And I'm vlogging with my phone because my camera is junk. I need to get a vlogging camera, guys. But I want to wait and see if it's even worth you know, but I cannot, cannot get over that. Who knew 10 pounds could shrink my waist that much? Oh, it's this little man. Hi, buddy. Hi. I think he is coming down with the bronchitis. His sister had it first. Now I have it, and I think he's got it. He's got a little bit of a fever. And he doesn't feel well. What do you got there, bud? I got some of the fishing baits. Little, got... little rubber fishing baits? Yeah. Hopefully you aren't getting sick because you won't get to use them. That's my favorite. Wait, hold that clear one up again. You guys, check this out. It, like, I know it looks like it's changing colors. It is not. It's just a clear rubber worm. But it's like hieroglyphic. <laughs> I, uh, it's like a prism effect. The way that it's done. So when the light hits it, it changes colors. And it is the coolest thing ever. I also got this one. Let me see. Let's do a close up. I want to see it. Hold still. You got to hold still, bud. Okay. So there's the detailing on that fish. It's not focusing on the bait. There we go. Um, It looks like a real fish. Mr. Hamster doing this morning. Hello, baby. Hi, what are you doing? Look at he likes the camera. He's like, yes. He's such a cutie. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Him and the cat play together. It's the cutest thing ever. You guys, so I just thought I would show you a little preview of our classroom. It's kind of a chaotic mess right now because I'm still organizing, printing off things and stuff. But this basically is what it looks like right now. If you guys had seen any of my Vlogmas videos from before, you will see that there is a giant table in here that was bar height. 
that I did some DIYs and stuff on. Anyways, I had built that table and um, in this corner, in this area here was a built-in desk and I made a, like a cushion and we put it up there and we used that cushion as a place to sit, almost like a breakfast booth. And then on the other side of the giant table was bar stools. Well, the table became not very well, um, how do I put this? We never used it. <laughs> and the reason we never used it was because it was up so high that the kids, <laughs> their legs dangling would go numb. And us adults didn't want to sit on bar stools because it was uncomfortable. So we ended up, I decided, let's cut the table in half to make two separate desks. Let's trim them down here. And so that's what we did. And we at uh, attached them to the wall. So we have like this giant L-shaped desk now, and it's got this really pretty like wood paneling for the cover. And you see this tape here and here. Basically what I did was I measured from that corner to that corner, and I divided by three, and then I taped it off in sections so each child had en enough room, or the same amount of room, but... And then I had my office area set up over here, but then I decided the kids are going to need a lot more space if they're going to be together five hours a day and not right next to each other. So I took my office back into my room. And so this section here is Haley's, that is Austin's, and that is Ivy's. And um, so, yeah, and then we have the whiteboard. So I can actually go into a more in-depth um, tour of this area once we get more organized and are ready to go and I can show you guys some things and if you guys want to see any homeschooling stuff ideas organization anything comment down below because I will share that with you guys um and then we just have this little round table here so that we can still sit at a dinner table and eat um and they're not eating at this desk area here so yeah it's pretty cool I'm really excited to start homeschooling the kids so you guys there are so many Kleenexes on the floor that is disgusting. So that needs to get cleaned up like now. Ready? Ta-da! All clean. It's kind of dark so you can't really see, but. <laughs> we have Papa Jay sleeping. <laughs> That's a piss in the baby. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm going to actually start lunch a little earlier today because for the first time since Sunday, I've had an appetite. Alright guys, so our lunch is done. Austin has two little green peppers and a cucumber, some sautéed green beans, a little bit of chicken and potatoes, and rice. I have potatoes and chicken, a little bit of rice, a little bit of green beans, and some cucumbers. He is going to drink milk with his because he loves milk. I'm going to stick to water. Hey guys, so this is what I have left. I couldn't eat it all. And actually there was a little more than this, but I gave some to the dog. I'm currently watching Lunchy Break on YouTube. If you guys have never seen this, you have to check it out. Jocelyn and Lily are so hilarious. Uh, the other day when I was sleeping the whole day, my daughter Haley was in here watching Beauty Break. And it just kept playing the next video and the next video. And she literally watched it for hours because they're so great. Hi, sweetie. What are you doing? What are you doing, sweetie? Huh? She wants more sweet potatoes. <laughs> but anyways, it looks like it's pretty nice outside. There's a tiny crack here. I haven't been outside except for taking the kids to school this morning. But I think... Um, Austin and I are going to take a little nap and then we might venture outside. I don't want him to lay around too much if he feels up to moving around because I feel like with him being younger that he might be able to kind of fight off the infection before it gets to the point where mine did if I keep him active and hydrated. So we'll see what happens. But anyways, guys, all right. Hi, Austin. How are you doing today? Good, but feeling a little sick. Oh, no, that's not good. I bet you I know what will make you feel better. What? The giveaway. Do you want to tell them what the surprise is? Uh, so, I've been sick and I haven't been able to announce the winners. And I promised in my other video that we would do something super nice since you guys were so patient. So, I'm doing what just 
to the five subscribers, we're going to give away to everybody who commented in the United States. So everybody that left a comment that is not international, telling us your favorite smell and your favorite color, color yep, is going to get something from us. So I will insert a list of the subscribers that qualify for the giveaway. So, if your name is on this list, you need to contact me and let me know your address so that I can send you what you want. I just want you guys to keep in mind, though, I am a mother with three children. I am a stay-at-home mother. I do not have a lot of income. My husband is a sole provider. So, with that being said, you will not receive anything, like, spectacular. But there are a couple of cool things that Mr. Austin here helped me pick out, and I think they're appropriate for the questions that we had you answer in the comment section below. And I'm pretty sure you guys will enjoy them because I ended up buying some for myself as well. I need you to contact me with your address. Please don't post it in the comments. If you can, send me a private message on YouTube so that it stays safe. And I'm thinking about opening a P.O. box, not because I expect you guys to send anything, but just simply to keep my privacy as well so that I can send those items to you. I'll probably get the P.O. box in a town I don't live in, that, but that's close enough to where I can check it if need be. So yeah, I will not be, like I said, getting the P.O. box so that you guys can send me stuff. I mean, if you wanted to, you, you can feel free, but I did not, I'm not opening it for that reason. And I do not expect you guys to send me anything at all. Right. We don't need them to send us anything. We just need them to comment down below videos because we like to interact with them and um, stick around, right? That's all, that's all we want them to do is just hang out with us and be our friends. They don't have to give us anything. Right. Yeah. <laughs> all right, what are you guys. doing, buddy? Lifting weights. Lifting weights. I'm building a mm. I already got one piece on. Austin, look at me. Hello. Hello. <laughs> what are you doing? What? What are you building? The wheels. For what? The race car. A race car, huh? Lifting weights. <laughs> I need a second weight in here. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> He's all your muscle. So how are you going to put the rest of it together? With glue. that all by oh, yourself Jesus. yes just with that is, this little bait that is so it's cool biting buddy my it's biting my how am i supposed to take this off well how about i put the camera down and i help you okay right. hey guys <laughs> so i'm still a wicked mess of course see but anyways so the kids aren't home yet because Ivy has an after school like club thing that she's in and Haley's at a friend's house so neither one of them will be home till after 6.30 and uh, Austin is currently taking a nap. So with that being said, I think I'm going to end today's vlog. I know it's not that late in the day, it's like 4.30 or 5 p.m. here. But I got quite a bit of vlogging done today, and so I want to get this video up, especially since the announcement winners are in there. So yes, 
Make sure you guys comment down below and let me know what you thought of day one vlogging. I know it was kind of boring. Uh, uh, the kids will be home this weekend, so it'll be a little more interesting. But anyways, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below if you think we should keep vlogging for the whole month of June. And also, congratulations to the winners. I appreciate each and every one of my subscribers, all 109 of you. Even those that weren't able to enter, don't worry, I will have things in the future that include you guys in the international giveaways. But anyway, so yes, you guys definitely get a hold of me with your addresses so I can send that stuff out. And I hope that you guys have a wonderful day. I will see you in tomorrow's vlog. Alright, goodbye!